This is going to be one of my favorite what I thinks ever. This time we're going to be checking out Nerdy Crafters. Not another craft kit. Let's go. Localtarians. All right, so first thing you guys are going to notice is I have some stuff going on in my face. Do not panic. Uh, you will see a video about this. If you, It should already be out. Uh, it was filmed last week on Wednesday when I went to the dermatologist to have some work done. So don't worry. I'm fine. It's healing. Sorry that it looks gross, but I could not wait to bring this video to you because it is amazing and I've been waiting for this to arrive and I'm so excited to share it with you guys. So welcome Localitarians and I hope that you guys are crafters or you like to make things because if so this video is going to be perfect to get you excited. So let's get started. So when I heard this person was printing out a craft kit. Now I'm not a huge craft kit person. All right I don't usually like to buy the craft boxes because meh meh you don't always know what you're getting well with this person i've been watching their videos for years i love what they do i think they're amazingly funny and uh, they tell it how it is so because of that they've got experience in dealing with really cruddy crappy craft kits so when they came out with their own i knew that it was going to be amazing and that it would have what we need in it to do the projects and be good quality stuff so if you haven't already figured out who i'm talking about yet we're talking about nerdy crafter now for those of you that don't watch nerdy crafter uh it is on youtube and she's amazing she's also on tiktok she does uh gaming as well on twitch so she's all over the place but she's amazing and she's been doing it for years and i'm sure many of you already knew who she was and look at this we have her not another crap kit and it has finally arrived i've been waiting for this for over a month and i'm excited and this is exactly when they said it would be ready we bought it as a pre-order situation and yeah it's amazing let me just look at the little artwork already now if you don't know nerdy crafter uh the whole premise is when you subscribe to her channel you become a grain of salt in their little salt shaker family so that's why there's a little salt. Uh, she has an alter ego called Salty Crafter. And uh, Salty Crafter is quite amazing at finding the crappiest of crap kits. Occasionally she gets a few winners too though. So let's see with somebody who spends that much time looking at everybody else's. Let's see what they put together for us for a craft kit. Now, there is a lot of stuff in here. And I'm really excited. This is the first time I've opened it, guys. I literally am unboxing it for the very first time right in front of you. So let's see what we get. And I love this. I don't know if you guys can see this. I'll try to zoom in on it at some point. But it has little, little dinosaurs and, and unicorns and a nerdy cracker in there sprinkling salt bay salt. Very, very cute. And, all right, so first thing we get is the uh, complete guide. Well, the beautiful thing about this is it's going to show you, there's a little sneak peek for you guys, what's in this kit. Pretty amazing. So it's going to show you some of the stuff in here and what you can do with it. And for any of you that are interested, there's some QR codes right there as well these are tutorials that are going to show you how you can use all the things in this kit to make all kinds of amazing things so now i have seen um videos where people have unboxed it so yes i know what i am getting in here and i'm very excited but once you actually have it in your hot little hands it changes things and you're even more excited so let's start off with the goodies all right so i'm pretty excited because i love i've been watching nerdy crafter for a while and i really love what she does and i'm so excited oh this is great so we got a holy carp sticker 
We got the This Is My Happy Face sticker. Love that. And I'm insulted. <laughs> Very cool. Very excited about these and I'll have to find some place extra special to put them. Pretty, pretty happy about that. So that's the first little, just kind of a little extra that you get. Got some discount codes in here that I'm going to just keep for myself. <laughs> and uh, I'll be able to get a discount. So now I know already there is a lot in here. And so we're just kind of going to go from what's on top to what's in the bottom and we can get excited together. All right. Now I'm going to back this up just a little bit so I can show off some items. All right. So first of all, I know how very long she put, she took about two years to put this together before it ever launched. Uh, she was testing items. She was going through different items and she wanted to make sure that she got us the best quality stuff she could. So we have the nerdy crafters slash smart, art, well, X smart art, uh, salty brush set. These are for acrylic watercolor and oil. And look at that very nice sizes really nice quality looking brushes and if I didn't already say I apologize this is a collaboration not only with nerdy crafter but smart art boxes and if you've never had a smart art box they do have some wonderful things but these are very cool they look very nice and this little one is very nice so uh, they've got some good sizes in here and a good variety of brushes to use so I think that'll be awesome all right so boom. It would not be a salty or nerdy crafter video if we didn't have a sharp pointy thing. <laughs> uh, and any of you who don't know what I'm talking about, go over and subscribe to Nerdy Crafter right now because if you don't, she will wave a sharp pointy thing at you. And you'll see what I mean if you watch her videos. And you certainly, certainly should. In fact, we'll probably link one up above for you. Right up there. All right, guys, so this is a, um, I guess you call it an owl, an owl or an owl, and uh, it is a sharp pointy thing that you can use to ream out beads. It's a reamer type of thing. Ream out beads. You can use it for a variety of things. Um, you could use it for poking holes in uh, clay beads. Uh, it's got a great amount of uses and that will come in handy. And this is a really nice one. Quite honestly, it is made of metal. So it's a super, super nice one. So we're going to set that there. All right. And Sculpey Tools. Now, I love this because I'm thinking of getting into some clay. And I've always wanted to do I've been watching everybody that does clay. And I'm very excited to get started. And so now I have these ball styluses are amazing tools for doing clay. But on the other end, boop, we have a silicone tipped, I believe. Uh, it may not be, it may just be a plastic tip, but either way, it's got the little, these are more tips that you can use, shapers basically. So, uh, yeah, so it's a dual end detail toolkit for clay work. Um, yeah, you could use it, mostly it's done for clay work. You could use it for uh, air dry, polymer, you know, whatever type of clay you want. All right, so speaking on clay. We also get some armature. Now this is, uh, let's see, 32 foot, 16 inch or 1.6 millimeter. Uh, it's sculpting an armature wire. So a lot of people put this in their uh, projects to um, make sure that their clay is going to stay after it's hardened in the right position. Give it a little more fortitude to make sure that nothing you know, gets in there and, and twerks it the wrong way and makes it break. And this will add a little bit of strength to things like your limbs, like arms and, you know, arms and things like that. Um, any of you who have ever seen Ace of Clay, I'm sure you've seen him use this a lot. So this is some good quality armature wire from Art Alternatives. So there you go. We got that. I'm excited. All right. We got a little paint palette. These are very cool. Oh, you can't have too many of those, honestly. Ooh, and this, guys, this is a really nice sharp pointy thing. All right, so this is a utility knife or a grip on knife is what they're calling it. Uh, and it is, it's got a safety cap and uh, it looks like it's Excel brand, which is a really wonderfully done brand. They do a lot of great work. 
and uh, yeah so these are very very nice that is awesome so yes pretty excited I actually do not have one of these I used to but I, mine broke I wasn't using Excel one you know what I'm saying all right so this is another cool thing that I have actually never seen until this kit I'd never heard of this till I saw somebody review her kit and I saw this is also from Excel it's called a state a sanding stick now the cool thing is you know you sand with this little edge right here or the back edge whichever makes it easier for you but this little thing rotates around so that you can get a, a nice new piece of sandpaper for small detail items kind of like this so this is pretty awesome also from excel and i think this will be very cool especially for clay work plaster work anything that involves sanding maybe even some resin work uh anything where you need to get into a finely detailed area this would be very cool all right now this is pretty neat and i think i am gonna open this i'm gonna pop it back in here when i'm done though just to show you guys all right, so she's a big proponent of getting upset with people that always say includes everything you need in the kit. It makes her angry, okay? So here is something that she included. Look at this. She gives you your own silicone bowl. And this is great for mixing up plasters, which you'll see why in a little bit as we go through this kit. Or whatever, it's got this cute little carbiner on it so you can attach it to things. Um, as you saw it folds flat like that so you can just slide it in on a little space on your workbench or a shelf or wherever you need to have it temporarily i am going to put it back in here to keep it safe all right pretty excited about that that is really neat not many people do give you that another thing that she was really adamant that she needed to give us a measuring cup seems like a little thing but you wouldn't believe how many craft kits don't include this simple item and it does have measurements on each side for metrics or in you know our normal like one cup versus uh, the metric side which is 250 I think it's cc's so yeah that's a very nice feature I mean you have your own little thing and I like that it has a pour spout on it too I think that's gonna make life a lot easier all right oh yes this guys i don't know if i can open it in here let me just take it out and i'll show you this could come in handy it's a collapsible funnel she really did want you to have everything so she tried to get you as many things in this kit as she could uh one thing you wouldn't receive with this kit i, I don't know if you can still get the kit but if you can um you wouldn't be able to get it with batteries they can't ship that most of her kits, I think, are coming from Canada, I believe. I know she's in Canada. I don't know if they are or not, but let me just put that back in there for safekeeping. That's pretty dope. Okay. All right. So this is something that I'm very excited about because, again, I mentioned I wanted to maybe get started doing some sculpture, and they're giving me what I need to do it. So I have some ultralight already, but this is super sculpty, and it's the medium okay and it comes in the gray uh this this particular brand comes in gray or it comes in like a flesh tone typically but they're giving you this huge block and i want to say it's a pound let me see here does it say yes one pound one pound of polymer clay i mean that is amazing it's an oven baked clay and uh it's the perfect mix of firmness for detail and softness for blending i'm very so we can start making some stuff you know that means guys more art times we're overdue for an art time as it is all right so i'm pretty excited about that but this is something else that i'm pretty stoked about because i've never tried this and i've always wanted to and this will give me a little sample enough to try it and i think that is really cool and then you can decide if you'll want it once you do it's called epoxy sculpt so if there's an item that you want to add on to uh that you're making and perhaps it doesn't uh, you can't bake it it's past the time for you to bake it or it's something you just couldn't possibly put in the oven or it's got plastic on it or rubber and you just couldn't put it in the oven well the upside is this will dry almost like clay 
but it's it's an air dry and it does take a little time for it to set and all that stuff you take part of a and part of b you mix them together in equal amounts and you can add little things like a tail or something to a sculpture you're making uh, or whatever but this is amazing stuff and I've seen a lot of people work with it and I'm really excited to get my hands on it so that's pretty exciting okay so I'm gonna show these together all right so first of all this is silicone mold obviously I think most of us know that you might notice these are kind of smallish yeah the intended idea is that they could be used for cabochons for eyes for sculptures but I mean honestly you could use these to print flowers in you could do whatever you want with them but what's really neat is that in here we have not just resin baby we have UV resin that's right uh, it's Sophie and Toffee's UV resin they're some of the top notch this is also a mold from them as well and uh, this is you just pour a little bit of this shine the little black light flashlight on it which oh look we happen to have <laughs> she does and it is also branded with nerdy crafter x smart art so you just have a little press button back here you got it for batteries in it because again they couldn't ship it with batteries but uh, you'll use that to harden this and it only takes about 30 seconds sometimes less pretty amazing stuff all right so let's see here and I think this is the alcohol ink. Yep, you hear that? Can you hear that? All right, so that noise is that this is alcohol ink and it's got, if I'm not mistaken, this has a shimmer in it. Yes, it's a rainbow alcohol ink. So it has almost like an opalescence. And I'm sure we'll play around with this at some point so that you can see what I mean. All right, so the last thing in this little bag, not in the box, we still got plenty in the box is just a red paint and this is acrylic paint so you get a red acrylic paint here and the reason it's in this bag uh she has a whole kit in here and those are jacquard brand by the way uh which is actually actually that one says uh neopage acrylic so yes that is the red acrylic that one is uh from jacquard brand and the jacquard brand is uh what she did all her other paints by she just couldn't fit another paint in the container they had all right so this brand is uh, marabou for the alcohol ink and as i mentioned sophie and toffee for the uv resin which it, i'm super excited about really am all right guys let me seal that back up and of course as you saw we got the flashlight so we can cure that when we get some mattress all right, so something else for sculpting. We have the oven bake clay adhesive. So anytime you're making something and you start stop in the midst or you need to join a, a bigger piece onto something that has been, you know, previously worked on, you would have to put some of this stuff on. Joining pieces like arms and legs, things like that. Or if you're putting something on an armature, you put this on the wire so that it will stick better and adhere better. And, uh, you know, that way it's kind of like a liquid clay almost, more or less, and it helps the clay adhere. So that's nice to have. So I'm going to set this over here as well. We're getting ourselves quite a mess. Let me get to these paints, and then we'll get to the stuff I'm real excited about. I mean, I'm excited about everything. All right, so this brand is, uh, is again, Jacquard, and it's their Luminaire collection. Nerdy Crafter X Smart Arcs Luminaire and Neopacu. I can't say that very well and I apologize right off the bat. Okay, so the luminaires are the, yeah, these are the shimmery ones and the uh, Neopake, Neopake I think it's called, are the opaque colors and as you can see she's put in every color you could possibly need from, you know, from uh, yellow, pink, blue, black, white, and brown and uh, she has a big complaint that they never include a brown in them and of course we got the red over in that other bag she just couldn't get it into this package because there were so many and here are the official names of those colors if you want to see them so that you can get some of your own there you go and these are very nice I've seen these worked with already and it looks like they work very well. Now, you know, things like the yellow. Yellow almost always takes more coats, but 
You know, this is a nice getting started situation right here. You got a little bit of everything. I mean, there's so much in this kit. All right, guys. Now, let's see here. Oh, yes. I forgot to mention a couple other little things. She includes popsicle sticks. It's one of those pet peeves that she has all the time that nobody ever includes anything to stir anything or anything like that. So I thought that was a nice touch. And then on top of that, her own spatula. So you can use it with your little bowl to stir things up. Very cool, right? I mean, it's a good size. I thought it would be really tiny, but it's actually a, a decent size. I'm very excited. Pretty impressed. All right, guys, you ready? Brrr, drum roll. We're ready for the stuff now. This is the thing I am most excited about. And if anybody else said that they weren't most excited about this, I don't know what to tell you, because that's crazy to me. All right, this is a custom piece that she made for this box. So I'm really excited because she worked very hard to make it in the perfect position and to make it so that we would be really stoked about using this. All right, you guys ready? It's a little mold. Okay, so this mold makes a little creature that looks like that. That's the front and that's the back. Those little things right here that make holes in your plaster or resin, you can use it for either one. Uh, it is so that you can add things like a tail or wings to your creature a little more easily. So yeah, you just print this together. Now mind you, I'm probably not gonna get it together right away, am I? But you know, quite honestly, it's really just a matter of finding that edge and running it down. And then you just have to make sure that it's together. Now, the other cool side of that, there we go, it's not too bad. So at any rate, it takes a little practice and a little finesse till you get the hang of how to make sure that this is all together. Once you figure that out, you'll be golden. It isn't all that hard, you just have to work at it a little bit. And it's gonna take me a minute to figure it out. You can see there's a rim here and a rim here. So this part will actually fit into that rim perfectly. And once it does, the other cool thing is she even included rubber bands. Pretty excited about this, guys. I can't really tell you how excited. But she tells you how to do these. And these are one-use one rubber bands. You know, if you're going to make more, she gives you enough for the three projects that you can make using this mold. Now, you can reuse this mold as many times as you want. This is now your creature. And the other cool thing that she addressed in one of her videos, which I thought was really nice of her, is that if you make a creature using this mold and uh, you want to sell it, you can do that. I was like, dang, that is really nice because she literally has rights to this. She designed it, she put her blood, sweat, and tears into it. But if you do do that and you have one of these and you decide to do that, do, do the nice thing, do the right thing, and make sure that you tag her on Instagram and show her your creations. She will be really stoked because I'm sure some of you got this kit and are just excited to see what it holds and to see what you're getting. It is very, very exciting for me. I mean, see, that wasn't so bad. I went about it the wrong way the first time and now we've got it. I think I'm gonna put it back in here like this. <laughs> and it's got a hole in the top so that you can just pour your plaster or this is also good for resin, guys. It doesn't have to just be plaster. You can use it for resin or plaster and uh, yeah she didn't give you any resin for that per se because you'd need a lot of resin but she did give us permastone permastone is awesome uh, it's from activa it's a basic minerals it says basic materials for creativity but this is a casting compound permastone is like a plaster basically and there's enough in here for three little dudes so that is amazing. Pretty excited to get into this. What I think I wanna do is I wanna make them, set up the little three dudes, and then maybe invite my nephews over and see what they can create with it. I think that would be a fun time. Now, one last item I did get in here. And I think that was it. That's everything after that. Pretty sure, I'm not seeing any other little treats in there is we get a Nerdy Crafters branded cutting board. 
it's got two sides to it very very cool so you could use either one and yeah it's not too big but you know it's perfect for putting under this project I think so very cool you could do some smaller projects on this it would be very nice and it's really actually very nice I don't see a name brand on here to promote or I would but it looks amazing so yeah it's got her little logo right on it that's pretty dope all right so we're gonna put that back in we're gonna keep our little dude together I'm gonna put him back in his bag all right guys well that is a lot of stuff that is an absolute lot of stuff um, you got all these great items and again I'm gonna kind of show them off as I'm printing them back in yeah man if there's any if they're still selling them you definitely want to get your hands on one now you might be asking me Amanda what'd you pay for this all right, so I did it in four payments uh, at the time. They were offering us a chance to do it in four payments of, you know, up to, I think it was up to uh, four payments of like $36.50 a month or something. Uh, anyway, it came out to $149. It might've been $149.99, but it was, no, it was $149, I think even. But look at all the things that you've got in here. And not just that, you get this custom piece that you'll be able to use over and over again. And you'll be able to use it for clay, for resin, either one. I mean, that is amazing. Yeah, we got it now. It's, it's closed now. We did it, it. So now we'd be ready to just rubber band it and start pouring in plaster. And I'm really excited to do that soon. Not today, not today, but we will do it soon. And of course, I'm gonna bring you guys there for it, of course. Let me just try to slide all of these goodies back in my box. Guys, I think I did it. <laughs> all right, so I'm really excited to uh, get into this and try it. Today it was just all about showing it to you guys. And uh, yeah, so that is that is everything I got in my nerdy, uh, my nerdy crafters, not another crap kit, craft kit box. <laughs> I want to say it properly because it seems that a lot of people have been calling it the crap kit and you know it's really not look at all the great stuff you got in there it is far from that and we don't want anybody to be confused by that at all amazing we did it it okay and it is a special collaboration with smart art box and again it is not another crap kit nerdy crafter smart art box all right, so if you can get a hand on these, you should. This is a lot of great stuff. It's gonna be so much fun to work with, and I, for one, am super excited. So yeah, if you get one or if you have one already, make sure you don't forget to tag Nerdy Crafter on Instagram uh, and follow her videos on YouTube, guys. She is amazing, and I couldn't be happier. I don't spend a lot out on YouTube influencer things, but this is one I could not pass up on because I know how strict she is about quality things. And you saw it for yourself. There is some great quality stuff in here. This is some name brand things that she put into this box. Yes, I paid 150 bucks for it, but I think that I got more than my value here. You're gonna be able to use that mold over and over again. And it was hand designed to be amazing. I've seen a lot of people make things with it already and it shows a lot of promise for adding wings and tails and just making the creature of your dream or you can just make him a little dude and fill those holes in with the epoxy sculpt or or more clay it's up to you there's lots of options so really excited uh, if you want to see more you can go over to her channel she's done some things where she shows you how she put this together she also shows you some things that she's created with it already. And if you look for Not Another Crap Kit on YouTube, you're going to see a lot of other creators out there that have already started designing things, including the legendary Chazza. I love him. He's amazing. If you don't know who that is, you are not into art. <laughs> He's great. He's an Australian artist on YouTube, and he is amazingly funny and definitely a as well. But at any rate, guys, that was it, and that is everything. And I hope that you guys absolutely enjoy it. And I wanna thank you so much for watching today. And peace, we'll catch you next time.
don't forget to like and subscribe and share with all your friends. And hit that bell so you know when we have a new video.